Washington's top news, WTOP. Facts matter. 545, I'm John Aaron. And I'm Michelle Bash. A new movie is out today. It's a sequel to Captain Marvel. We destroyed Thanos. But it's not over. It's called The Marvels, and we talked about it with Kuya P of Nerds Rule the World. Yes, the Marvels. We have Captain Marvel, played by Brie Larson. We have Tiana Paris, who is Monica Rambeau, and Amon Vellani, who is Miss Marvels. Uh, we've seen Monica Rambeau in the WandaVision series on Disney+. Plus. We've had Amon Vellani in Miss Marvel, and of course, Captain Marvel, Brie Larson in all the big movies. They're all together now. We have the most amazing superpower team of women in the Marvel Universe banding together for this threat that ties to the past of Captain Marvel, something that she did brought up this new threat, um, but it's so much fun. We have Samuel L. Jackson returning as Nick Fury, another batch of special appearance too, but uh, of uh, some other people we love that I don't want to give away and spoil, but uh, I would say that this new film is F-U-N. So much fun, and it's also going to develop a lot of uh, some of the things we've been seeing into where we're heading now with the Marvel Universe, and a lot of people have been talking, where's it going? Where's it going? How is this tying into everything? But I think a lot of people are going to be happy with this. Very surprised. I'm so excited for the future, and it may change what we already know, John Ooh, and Michelle. That's interesting. Intriguing. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have another movie that appears to have Paul Giamatti being Paul Giamatti. Yes. Did you see Sideways? Did you love Sideways back in yes. the day? Yeah, I yes. Yeah, I remember it. I didn't, I, you know, I, I wasn't crazy about it, but I remember it. <laughs> okay, well, it's a classic. I'm not big I'm not a rom-com. Person. I'm just not a rom-com guy. Oh, I got you. Well, I think you might like this one. He's teaming up again with director Alexander Payne, who wrote Sideways. He's writing this one again. Uh, we have Paul E. G. as like this cranky professor in like this New England town way back in 1969, 1970. Um, we have uh, some kids that are holdovers because they can't go home for Christmas. Their family isn't available. Something happens. So they're kind of stuck at school. Uh, Paul's uh, professor character is having to oversee them along with the cook uh, of the school, uh, played by Divine Joy Rand. Off. Um, they're all kind of stuck together, and we have a new star in Dominic Sessa, who's like the smart teenager, but also a little bit of a troublemaker. I think Paul E.G., Paul Giamatti, that's my new term for him, <laughs> is going to get another nomination for this. This is going to be one of those films he's nominated for uh, come award season because he plays the heck out of this role. But this Dominic Sessa as well is a star to look out for. This is his film debut, and he kills it. On Skype, that's Kuya P of Nerds Rule the World, which previews the latest in film, TV, and streaming, and occasionally he'll check out local events, too. 